We just can't seem to get enough of these W211 series Mercedes-Benz. This particular car is an estate and it's called an E280. So it's got the 3 litre V6 engine and it's got the newer 7 speed gearbox. Being an elegance it's got very nice burl timber inserts. The car is in particularly good condition. It's got part electric seats and it's a sport. So it's got the very nice sport alloy wheels, body kit. You can see it's got the twin exhaust system at the back. This particular car is a seven seater. This in the back is just for storage. You can take that out and put it in the garage if you are using the very back seats. If not, they fold. They fold in and actually give you a completely flat surface to work with. This is reliable, economical, and safe. If you're looking for a family car and you've got young children, you've got to get one of these Mercedes wagons. I'm sure we've all seen plenty of old Mercedes wagons getting around from the 70s, 80s and 90s. I've seen the W124, which, from, which was from the late 80s. I've seen some getting around with seven and 800,000 kilometres. So for a car like this with 154,000 kilometres and a perfect Mercedes-Benz service history from new, it's certainly got a long life ahead of it. Every single service has been done at Macintosh of Mossman. It's got continental tyres. And I think if you're going to get one of these station wagons, you've really got to get the sport. The wheels just look fantastic. It's got front and rear parking sensors. And it comes in this beautiful grey colour with black interior. This car would have been about $150,000 or $160,000 when it was new. And we're looking for under $20,000, just under $20,000. It's got automatic headlights, cruise control, and it's Bluetooth compatible. Let's get in it. And start it up. Just don't need my seatbelt here. <laughs> Um, so put the auto lights on, put some windows up, close the sunroof, that light just tells me that I need to put my seatbelt on. You've got your six stacker in here, you've got your switch for your rear wiper, you press this button to put the headrest down. When you take off the car locks itself so you just press that to unlock it if someone's trying to get in. It's got dual zone climate control. The next service is a minor service, which is called an A service in Mercedes terms. It's not due for 11,400 kilometres, which is great. Move this inside. It's also got factory front and rear parking sensors. And this V6 is silky smooth. It's one of those cars, I might just put my seat, but I'll set up that red light, does it come up? It's one of those cars, you get to a set of lights and you've got to look down to check that the car's still running because it's so smooth. Surprisingly, the Mercedes-Benz station wagon E-Class was about $10,000 more than the sedan. Yet, second-hand, there's, there's really not that much of a difference at all. We have about six Mercedes E-Class sedans available at the moment. This is the only wagon, because they are quite rare. A lot of people who buy them, they tend to hold on to them. This looks like a one-owner from the Mossman area. They've bought it new, they've done 154,000 kilometres before they've traded in, which is pretty impressive. There's the beepers. So, because people hold on to them, there's just not a lot on the second-hand market. But we do buy a lot of these E-classes because they're just so reliable for us, even as a dealer. Something like this with a service history like that from Mercedes-Benz, we can simply buy it, put a price on it, and sell it. I mean, there's a few marks on the wheels and things, 
which we can get sorted. And it still needs a good detail, but for a family car with 154,000 kilometres, it certainly is very good. Thank you so much for watching. We are the Old Timer Centre. We're located in Marrickville, and we look forward to hearing from you.